this, make this borderless. We'll pop over to this. <clears throat> um, all right. So I've, uh, if you guys missed out on the, uh, the video that I did, uh, or put out this, this week, um, I made a, uh, a little apothecary here that, uh, I'm pretty stoked about. I think it looks great. I'm very happy with it. I think that we should spend this stream working on, I think I wanted to do like a blacksmith or a tannery. I think I might do tannery because there's always a blacksmith, you know? Um, although I don't know. Blacksmith would be handy because we get an anvil and stuff down here for people to use. Um, I do also want to move all of my storage stuff uh, to that room because I don't think anybody's taking it. Let's see. Nope, still empty. Okay, so we'll make that a storage room. So we'll move all this stuff over there. Um, I don't think I left that on. Oh, it's being used. Nope, it's all done. We have one thing of cobblestone being worked up and a bunch of coal being wasted <laughs> across these. Let's see. That's maybe about four. I don't know. Oh, Howdy. Samurai is making glass. Okay. Marky Mark, thank you very much for the tier one. I appreciate it, man. Uh, I'll turn that back on. Um... Yeah, I had a bunch of stuff in here and some potatoes and the bricks and stuff I was using for down here. But uh, I love this apothecary. I think it came out great. I'm, I'm really proud of it. Uh, we need to make a gate for right here. That's something I haven't done yet. Um, I've also kind of toyed around with the idea of making this light where you can flip it on and off. But then I would probably need to put something here and, you know, I don't know. I think it's probably easier just to leave a lantern in there, you know? Um, but first, before we get into all that, uh, like working on moving all this stuff over and working on whatever's going to go in that little hole, I want to explore the rest of Nuptown because I have uh, I have not seen the rest of it, and uh, I want to check it out. We have... Uh, let me go grab my other fireworks, too, so I can fly around a bit. These ones, because these are my slow ones. I think. Holy cow. Wait. Oh, okay. Um, holy cow. Kim's maze is going nuts. But uh, we got this giant bridge here, and then uh, that build, and holy cow, what the heck is going on over here? Um, someone's building a crazy statue. <laughs> Why does this look like a character from RuneScape? Whoa, and we have a whole gate thing here. And it looks like uh, Evan and them have... Oh, my gosh. Whoa. Whoa, what is what has happened over here? Holy cow. Who built all this? No. This is This is crazy. There's no way that Evan did all this. Hey, Bearded. Sorry. Um, hello, Mr. Hello Brazil. Hello, Brazil. Work. Um, Lucid. Lucid did all this. Holy cow. That dude can build. That is wild. Okay, all right. I don't wanna. I don't wanna get into it right now. We need to. We need to go back and 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 check out what's going on over here. In, in proper nub town. Uh, so we have uh, uh, Mercedes little cave here. I want to check in to see if anybody's built anything extra down there. Armor trim shop is now open. Is the is that the trim shop? I, I don't think I've ever asked where it was or if it was over here across the bridge. Uh, this. I've been keeping my fishing rod around because it lets me run fast. Is 
The Sakura tree is the armor trim place? Okay. Yeah. All right. Cool. All right. Looks like some Endermen are dropping off uh, presents for whoever's building this. Looks like it's unfinished currently. I think they were working on the bridge for a long time, so that makes sense. And we still have that, like, mine quarry thing that we need to wor uh, work about, too. Maybe I'll maybe I'll start working on that project after I'm done down here. And holy cow, there's another cool build over there. All right, hold on. Keep keep focused. Keep focused. I like the look of this. I like the um, light blue terracotta. Make it fab. <laughs> Whoa! Holy cow! Oh, damn, that is so clever. Armor stand, iron boots, coat, bandolier, tricorn. It's going to be a little hard, I think, to see the trims. Um, so you kind of have to, like, compare them, I guess, to them side by side here. This one's got, like, a little football helmet. <laughs> uh, rib armor trim. Only found a nether fortress. Requires netherrack to craft. Snout armor trim found only in bastion remnants requires blackstone to craft. That's cool. Ooh, this one has emerald. I would assume that this one requires emerald. Requires cobblestone. Oh, what? <laughs> Sentry armor trim only found in pillager outposts. Okay. Hey, Lucid. Uh, you were the one that built the 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 dock area back there. I've heard. Um need to go uh need to go check that out uh after we're done checking out the proper area <sighs> this guy's short why are you so short vex armor only found in woodland mansions requires cobblestone craft none on the server or someone has scrolled it away oh okay so we don't we don't have it yet okay that's why it's not on a pedestal this one has like copper accents does the hat change? It does a little bit. It can have goggles. Oh, or a black bill with a skull. Wild armor trim. Only found only in jungles. Requires mossy cobble. Coast armor. Only found in shipwrecks. Interesting. Why does this one get, like, metal fists? <laughs> oh, and it has skulls on his boots, too. That's cool. Ooh, this looks like a husk. Dune armor, yeah, found in desert temples. That's dope. That one looks really cool. This one has to be the emerald one. Prismarine, damn it. <laughs> Tide armor. And he's got like little googly eyes or something up there. Yeah, so the, the armor thing is coming from... Um, the grimdark pirate set here which is the one that gives us the, the cool pirate outfits um two diamond blocks per template that's dope this is cool i like to seeing the examples too is this all yeah it's all iron okay because uh i think netherrack or not netherrack netherite it's it looks it looks red instead of blue which is weird because i think you you you'd think that diamond would be this blue leather you know in the pack but that's iron hmm. i don't think i even have enough diamonds to buy one of these templates <laughs> i armor trim only found in strongholds Um, I guess he has like a little book on his, on his hip here and an eye patch <laughs> or no, it's a monocle. Never mind. Holy cow. Bro's got a monocle. This one has like claws on it. That's crazy. Spire armor trim only found in end cities across purper. That looks like it's the only difference. 
is that it has like claws or something. I've seen this one. We've used this one, I think. Wayfinder. Yeah, because I the, the like goggles. I've seen. What is what is the one that's on this one? Yeah, that's this one. This one is on is Wayfinder, I think. Holy cow, my hat is or helmet's gonna explode soon. I think I got some repair notes. Um, this one's like has a blinder and like metal cuffs, razor armor. Only found in trail ruins and suspicious gravel. What the heck? What's a trail ruin? Oh, so what? A, f a fox mask? Shaper. Also found in trail ruins and suspicious gravel. Oh, that's part of the archaeology stuff, isn't it? Oh, excuse me. It must be part of the archaeology stuff because I, I have no idea what it is. This one's got a little smile to him. Host armor. Ooh, this one's cool. I don't know if that's supposed to be like a chin strap or what, but this one's cool. Ward armor. Only found in ancient cities. Silence armor. Only found in ancient cities. What What is it? Is it ancient cities what they're called in? Uh, is that what the, the cities in the end are called? Man, I the last like two updates I really need to study up on. I, I need to I need to go out and find. I need to go and find all these things, you know. Um, let's take a quick peek at Mercedes area. Ancient city is the warden. Oh, that's why. Yeah, warden's still too spooky for me right now, so I haven't uh, I haven't seen him yet. Do we still got a sniffer down here? Which apparently Mercedes didn't bring him down here, because he was also shocked to see one. Open to anyone, Mercedes. Oh, that's nice. I like these little mushroom lights. How did I not notice these? Oh, there he is. Hey, little fella. How you been? You still sniffing? Okay. All right. I'll leave you be. He do be sniffing, you know? I think Marzetti did say, though, if anybody's interested, I, I think he said that you're allowed to, to build, like, a little place down here, too. Um, if you wanted to do something. Yeah. Anyone is welcome to join. Uh, okay. Um, I also really like these little archways that whoever is building. These things look really cool. Uh, I'm not sure how far to space them apart. Ah, okay. So Merzetti's making these. I like them. Are these anvils? Holy cow. These are expensive. Um, and I like the hanging pots too. I think they look very cool. Maybe he's trying different styles here just to see what, what works and what doesn't. I think I might. I think I kind of like the overhang ones. I don't know. What do you guys think? Maybe the overhang ones with. The, uh, I assume the soul lanterns put off as much light as the regular lanterns, with shaders on. Um, probably better to go with soul. No, they don't. Okay, so they are they are dimmer. Hmm. That was me and Merzetti pick to the overhang. Okay, yeah. I uh yeah, I think the overhang looks cool. I, I really like these arches. Um these arches are super cool. Also my wife is vacuuming, so if you hear that, that's that's what's going on. Um I like this. This is very cool. Uh I think maybe a trap door over the lamp just to cut the brightness a little bit um but not one that covers it all the way although this is this is just my texture pack you know doing its thing maybe like a bamboo one 
think bamboo might look all right. I'm not sure. I don't know. I'll leave it up to you guys. This looks crazy at night now, though. Like, whatever's going on over here now, that looks crazy. Um, let's check this out, and then we'll go check out whoever's house that is, because that looks very cool. I think that's Marky's, isn't it? Marky, I think I saw you over there, right? Oh, Samurai Shampoo is the one working on this. I think I said Ryu last last week. Who <laughs> let the dogs out? <laughs> well, Samurai, these are all yours. So, ooh, this thing, this thing's gonna be like bright in here, you know? Hello, self-proclaimed Shogun King of Nuttown. <laughs> He's taking it upon himself. I mean, if you're gonna build yourself a castle. I think that you have the right to just give yourself whatever title you want, you know? That makes more sense on the on this on the the statue thing too, because it does look like a, a shogun style thing. Oh, I don't want it to be raining. It's too loud. Uh Weather world clear, I think is what it is. Yeah. I'd vote for him. <laughs> All right. Well, I mean, I don't think that voting matters if uh, they're self-proclaimed, right? Jesus Christ. I thought I activated that. I was like, damn, that's fucking loud, man. Oh, I need that. <laughs> um, I really like how everybody's design and like building abilities and stuff like that has kind of evolved over the years. You know, you can just kind of tell that like there's a lot more kind of thought about little details from what I've been seeing on everybody on the server, which is great. I, I love it. I, I think it's. I think it's great because there has been in the past just a lot of kind of like this is a really cool build, but you don't think about maybe the stuff around it or uh, what goes in it, which is something I'm very guilty of. Um, but the couple of stuff that like I've seen Saj build, uh, he's really put in a lot of effort around the outside and on the inside of things. Um, obviously, you know, stuff that's still a work in progress, you know you need time to, to play around with it. That's how my brain works is like, I need to create the space and then I just kind of like take things in and out, you know, to make them, uh, uh, how, how I want them to be the spineless tome enchanter. Oh, okay. So this is like an enchanter place. Oh, that, that spooked me. I thought it was another player. Oh, spineless tome. Feel free to edit bookshelf layouts to suit your enchanting needs. All supplies are free. XP not included. Well, that's nice. The visitor's log. <laughs> All right. Um, do I need to? I need to take the book, right, to edit it. Yeah. Do it. Oh wait, no. We don't want to sign. Cause sign sign finalizes it. <laughs> Imagine I'm just the last one. I'm just like, ah, yes, this is we're done here. <laughs> Saja's builds are very co uh, cozy. I wish to steal his abilities. Friend and I are making a spot, but I'm getting picky. I mean, like, you, you gotta, you gotta, the whole point of Minecraft is changing the environment to suit your needs, right? So, like, find something that just is adequate and then you, you change up. You, you, you work your way through things. Uh, so, books? Oh, man, so many books. So much lapis. A lot more bookshelves, too. Um, that's cool. The lava is crazy, though. That's a crazy move. Um, but it looks like you got it contained. Oh, are these all different, like, levels? So, um, I guess I don't need three books. I just need one because I'm trying to test the... Oh, no, this goes up to 28. 
It goes up to 30. Maybe it's just like to give you different options for the lower level stuff. So there's like a 17 there. There's a horse? <laughs> Sorry, was that you? <laughs> oh, Beard died. Other floor still under construction. Okay. Um, <clears throat> Marky, are you using the same texture pack as, as us, or? Banner right here. Hello? Why is this lava making horses? Horse noises. You're not? Okay. Are you using MS Paint by chance? That's probably what he's using. I'm just going to ignore what he said and just put on MS Paint and we'll, we'll look at it. Okay. Yeah, this is definitely, this is definitely how he wanted it to be seen. Um, so, okay. This is an interesting choice. Um, I don't think I would make some of these creative decisions, but, um, you know, some of my other texture pack is, is bleeding over. Um, yeah. Okay. All right. Yeah. Very interesting. All right. We'll just get, we'll just get rid of that. Um, dang, is that the giant statue that that person was building over there? That's crazy. Lucid, did you build this statue too? Because, like, I know Evan and his, his friends and, and, and Roman and stuff, they're, they're building inside this mountain. No? Julian did the statue. Holy shit. Y'all are crazy. Also, look at how much progress this area is versus this. Like... This is so like classic Minecraft where it's just like a bunch of paths and then to like a build, you know, where this is all cohesive. But I mean, when you got like one or two people working together on something that that's going to happen, you know. Um, but yeah, that's that's crazy. Ooh. Oh, there's the horse. You were the one making big bill. You were the one making all the noise. Uh, okay. And then we have Kim's maze over there. I don't want to spoil, so I'm going to leave that alone. I see someone doing something up here. Someone starting off something. Uh, Little Rose. Okay. Going to be overlooking Nubtown. Pretty cool. Uh, okay. Let's, um... Go a little bit further down this path. Figure out what's going on here. Say choose casino. Uh, casino. Okay. Can use some iron for hoppers and Minecraft carts. Oh, yeah. There, Evan, holy shit. Evan just dropped off a ton of iron. That's dope. Card shuffler. Open top floor. More coming soon. Okay. I'm I am interested in how you're going to do a casino, my my dude. This is this is crazy. Uh, all right. Uh, we got a little bridge over here. Is this just a bridge over to Samurai's area? No. Just a just a little bridge over the lava pit. That's cool. Ooh, I like this place. This place looking good. Here, I'll um leave you a potato. And then we have just a regular old Minecraft village here. Uh, do we have a pathway over to this area? Or are we just using the little dinky village one here? Because we, we need to connect these two places. We definitely need to connect these two places. Yeah, it doesn't look like there was one. Yeah, we need a road. A road or a tunnel or something. Because, yeah, there's no... There's no way over here. Let's uh let's let's take a little flight around. Oh, there's a lighthouse over here too? There's so many other builds like going on around here. 
Oh, there's... Oh, no, that's the abandoned one. Someone's building a wizard tower. Or a couple. This statue is crazy. Oh, is it supposed to be uh, Poseidon? Because there's a trident. Connecting on the other side of Psionix build with that bridge. It is. Okay. This is this is crazy, Julian. This is wild. He is the one who blew a hole through the mount. Oh! You guys are coming up with your own fucking lore and shit, too? What the fuck? <laughs> you guys are fucking really going. Oh my god, this What the fuck? I'm 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 blown I feel I I was just on the server like working on my little underground area over there when I had time. And I just I just didn't go over the little mountain that's here and this whole thing has emerged. This is insane. <laughs> it's like I'm walking into a different server, man. This is nuts. The cannons? Who is paying you guys? The fence, even the fences are are so cool. What why are they different? Is that just what the texture pack does when you put fences next to each other? It must be, right? Cuz they're both spruce. Is it gates? I mean, yeah, I know they're gates, but like the the height difference is what I'm talking about. Sorry, the how it goes up and then down like that. Cuz they're all three spruce. So I wonder if the resource pack is is doing that. Like a connected texture. It just that's what happens with Minecraft gates now. Minecraft crazy, man. You guys ever play it? <laughs> I apparently have not played Minecraft. That's nuts. That's a cool feature, though. I'm glad that they did something like that, so it's not just, like, all same-samey. Okay, let's, let's pop back down. Looks like ground floor is where all the action's at. Little dog house. Complete with dog. Little fish market. We got a C three PO over here. <laughs> uh, you guys got to replace these fish with ones from the fishing comps. Drying out some fish. That's 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 an interesting way of doing that. With the campfires. You got a live one in here. What are you doing with that live fish? Okay, I saw these boats earlier is this just supposed to be like a boat store is that what it is like a boat rack okay so, so like like when you see like a, a rack of like kayaks or like canoes or something right you should really learn from this one guy who went by potato orgy he was ahead of his time <laughs> i i feel like that guy had a lot more free time on his hands and um and and played Minecraft for like sixteen hours a day. So, um, I heard he got a job though. So, <laughs> uh, do doesn't have doesn't have a whole lot of free time anymore to to do crazy builds. Listen, I'm I'm I was happy to to knock out that apothecary in in the day that I did. I had I had enough time to like knock that one little area out. I'm I'm getting there. It's just it needs to be it. I'm I'm a longer time span than. Than a week or two, you know. I'm 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 the slow burn. I love all the texture. Also, I don't know if you guys are using the same texture pack that I am, but it looks great. I I love the way it looks in this texture pack and this palm tree, bro. Fucking killing it with the shaders and stuff. Like this this place is banging. Honestly, it's it's pretty wild because it really brings me back, you know, when um, like Mongoose Country and stuff was like really popping 
when we just had a ton of people just building tons of crazy, crazy stuff. Oh, <laughs> it's like we're we're on on set or something. It's like don't open the doors. There's nothing behind the doors. <laughs> yeah, sorry, sorry. Hey, just FYI, you guys can slash lock doors. So if you do want to keep a door secret or something like that, just 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 come over here and lock it. It's okay. And then people can't open it except for you guys. Um oh, look at this. Like a like a rope bridge or something. Ah! <laughs> this is dope. I I need to hire you guys to make the next spawn map. I think I like if you guys would be down for that, I will pay you money to make a spawn for us. Cuz I love this detail. This is crazy. Cuz I paid people for the current one and it's fine from a distance, but you could definitely tell like the people that built it are like they're building spawns for like faction servers and and like mini game servers and stuff, not not for like survival stuff. Um, which is what, you know, I want us to be, I want to, I want to I wanna do survival type stuff. Ah, oh, it's so cool. Just got a totem of them dying. You can lock these frames too. I don't know if you have. You did. Ah, oh, you guys, you guys are on top of it, man. Y'all are on top of it. That's dope. I just, I, all the layers to things and everything. This is so cool, man. Hello. <laughs> What's in here, huh? <laughs> just gonna just gonna toss a couple of potatoes down there. We'll just pretend we didn't see anything. <laughs> um Yeah, this is crazy. This is really cool. I'd love to see like some some um actual text on the signs though. Like just give these places names or something, you know? I think that would really go a long way. This is crazy too because like I've seen I've seen a lot of like the people that get hired to do work for Microsoft for like um different Minecraft events and everything like that. The people like Pearlescent Moon or um Gemini Tay, uh Dr. Bond, uh Aurelius Sama, um, who would not would not he just kept giving me shit for saying his name wrong, but that's what I'm saying. Um, he, uh, uh, all of those guys, they, 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 they build kind of like this where it's, it's a little bit of a shell. So there's like not a whole lot of interior, but it doesn't need to be, you know, because like you can go back in and work on a lot of that stuff afterwards. You can go in and just like dig out like a small little room and that's it or whatever. But like, Spending this much time on the outside, which is what you're going to see 80% of the time, 90, 95% of the time, is all this outside part. Like, this is insane. Like, just this just this shot of, like, all the different builds, uh, buildings and stuff like that, the different textures and different types of buildings, um, the little markets, the stalls and stuff like that, the wagons. Like, it does... If you don't know what you're looking at, it may look kind of jumbled, but I uh, just it really feels lived in. This is dope. I love the lights too. This is crazy. Like this these little flower stalls are so cool. So simple, but they're so cool. Like, you know, it doesn't need to be a giant, like, build or anything like that. Just, you know, throw some trap doors, a little shelf, throw some flowers on it, you know? This one, going from the chain, it doesn't it doesn't quite reach the chain, but that's okay. We get it. It's Minecraft. And these, like, banners, too, are very cool, too. We'll get to those in a bit. I'm just going to keep walking around saying, like, oh, this is very cool. This is cool. I liked it. This is cool. 
little shop of some sort. Perhaps a blacksmith. We got a minecart pulling in goods. Hello. Uh -oh. Can I use this waystone? No. It's a private waystone. All right. All right. What's behind door number one? An actual mine. Ah, you guys, you guys had me fooled there for a second. It's kind of my house. I mean, like, I I dig it. You know, it's like a. I don't know. It's a it's a nice way to mask a house. You know. All right. Let's go down. Check out the dock side. What about this? Oh. Oh, you can still see behind the door. I thought it blocked you from opening it. Ooh. Little treasure room. Oh, that spooked me. <laughs> Dock storage. Julian, you were the one that had uh, that killed Evan, right? And then I came after you because it, <laughs> the server put a bounty on you. I was just fucking around with you guys. And then Evan later that day was like, what the fuck? Like, <laughs> I'm being attacked or whatever. I got a bounty on me on day one that I started playing the server. Why is the server owner attacking me? But in reality, I was just, I was flying by and I thought it would be funny to do a drive-by with the, with the tridents. It's really hard to hit people when you're flying around. This, man, this, this is dope. This is so cool. Oh, and you got the crane with the portal. That's so sick. Ah, the little aquarium. I don't know about the glow. Like, I, I think maybe it's just because the shaders, like, put too much bloom on it. You know? Cause it kind of, it almost looks artificial where everything else just kind of fits the theme, but I, I, it's just, it's just the shaders that are making it look that way. This is sick. Uh, no samurai. Um, the idea is to provide more ways of you guys getting those repair notes. Uh, it's just that's the first the first stage of how we're handling it is is um, is is breaking down so you don't like have to carry like tons of old equipment you know but no I I it would be crazy because you're gonna obviously run out of old gear and getting repair notes would be very difficult you know so there's gonna be other ways we just haven't had the time to like sit down and work on it yet so. Um, Yeah, I probably I probably should put some effort into doing something like that this week. Um, I'm not sure how to do that. I don't know if you guys want it to just be like a straight money conversion. Like you just use money to buy the repair notes or um, maybe item conversion. Like you trade in like a stack of like, or I don't know, maybe 10 or 20 uh, we'll do Minecraft increments, 16 copper bars for like a 20 or 30% repair note or something like that. No, because there's, there's a shit ton of copper on the server. So that devalues those ones. Yeah. Um, I don't know. I'm open to suggestions of how you guys want to receive those repair notes. Maybe we can make it like a weekly bundle. Or something like that, a weekly kit where um, you guys just get like a like a half dozen repair notes every week for free for just playing on the server, you know? We could do something like that, something simple. That way that way there's still like free ways of getting the repair notes. Copper for common, iron for uncommon, diamond for rare and emerald. Well see that's the thing though, is that like on the pirate map there's a fuck ton of diamonds and emeralds and stuff like that. Like the generation on that map, if you want those types of items, there's a ton over there. Um, but there's less 
amount of the other materials. So you need to come to like the regular oh. map for iron and everything like that. Um, so. Dwight, your building style is awesome, though. <laughs> I mean, no, it's just like it takes time, and I unfortunately my my free time is just crazy limited right now, especially with Computex. Like Computex, it's over now. Computex just ended, so um, you know my my time has has opened up a little bit more. There's more that we gotta check out too. Um, I'll just swim over to whatever this is. And um, <clears throat> so I'll have a little bit more free time to to work on some server stuff and, and get um, the notes. But there is just, you know, my weekends where you think that I would have free time. That time is then spent with, like, friends, <laughs> you know, like we got D&D &D tomorrow and that, that takes up a significant portion of the day. Um, man, these stone brick walls look dope in this pack. In-game money as well as bundles. Yeah, I think if we do in-game money, we'll make them kind of expensive. Because my thought process for the repair note thing is that it would be another thing that you guys can throw up on the auction house, which is empty right now. Um, but like for people that do have a lot of items, but maybe want to throw out a repair note or something, you could throw it up there and make some money off of it, you know, just for the ease. Um, because that's how I would want to do it. I'd just be like, okay. So then we got to come out with a value for each of these notes. So what is the value of 10% repair, you know, um, which is the equivalent of 10 items basically because of the common essence, right? Which I think I might change that. I think I might change the, the, the balance of those. I know it's a little late cause you guys all broke down your equipment, but better to change it now than never. Right. Cause we're trying to, just balance things. I think 10 common essence for just 10%. I think that's too low. Um, so I might change it to like three, four common essence for 10%, you know, five, 10 K for common. That seems a little high. Well, I don't know. Five K. I think five K is okay. I think five K is okay. Cause like you're getting, you're getting money just by playing on the server. You get money. If you, uh, increase your rank, you get money through P rewards, which I should see if I have any. I don't. I do get my hourly reward though. Oh, I already got that though. That's auto That one's automatic. That one accepts automatic. Um, you get a shit ton for this stuff. So, which by the way, if you just do P slash P rewards, you can hover over these things and it tells you what it is. So for every 24 hours of play time, you get 25 grand. You get a thousand for every hour you play. Hi, Evan. How you doing? Um, and then there's a seven day and a 30 day reward. These, I believe, are just one time. Um, but on the seven day one, you get um, five elder keys for you and then two for everybody else that's on the server at the time. So if you claim this, if you care about the other people, uh, maybe wait for like, you know, days where there's a lot of people on. Typically server Saturdays, weekends, you know. Um Although I've been seeing a lot of people just throughout the day, just throughout the weekdays that are playing on the server, which is great. You know, that's what you want. Uh, and then the 30 day one, that one's, that one's a big one too. Um, so I can, um, yeah, I think, I think, what about 3k? three K three, 3,000 doubloons for a 10% repair note. I think, I think that sounds okay. Because that's like you play the game for three hours. Most people play Minecraft for a couple hours at a time, right? You know, if you have the time. Uh, for me, it's like an hour, maybe two hours. But like, I think, yeah, you play three hours, you get, you can afford a 10% repair note. And 10% on the big items, on stuff that has like a ton of durability, you know, that that's going to go a long way. Or anything that has unbreaking, you know, that'll, that can go a long way. And, uh, you get like on like a like an average fishing competition because we up the price of it, which I might up it again. I don't know if you guys would be interested in that. Maybe upping the price a little bit more for the fish you sell from fishing competitions, because now I'm getting like between 
five to like eight thousand doubloons f- per fishing comp for the fish that I sell, and I haven't gotten any legendaries. Um, and I think if you get a legendary, that that hits big. That's if you have enough to do a comp. I know, yeah, that's what I mean. But we will right now because there's the net, uh, there's a competition that's going to start in an hour, at noon, every two hours. So. Um, you can work back and forth from noon on every day if you want. I think actually he has a, um, yeah, more fish times. So there's a command in game where you can see the times that the fishing comps happen. Um, so, um, you can, you can work that out on your own. (laughs) So, yeah, I think, uh, I think I'll probably add... I'll add the ability to buy the notes as well. And then I'll change this common essence one to maybe. Yeah, I don't know. We spent so much time figuring out a way of doing the essence and then changing that essence to the repair notes too. Um, but I think just, just for longevity and just so you guys can keep using the cool stuff, like I want you guys to be able to use the stuff that you like, um, whether it be our custom items or even items that you enchant, you know, because that's a thing too. I mean, I know a lot of people that have made their own custom enchanted stuff. Uh, the repair notes work for those as well. So, um... Just, just want to add like an extra layer of, you know, stuff to mess around with on the SMP server. Where, in reality, don't need to do any of that. If you don't care, just go full vanilla equipment. Put, just put fucking mending on everything. I hate mending. I hate mending. I think mending is so shitty for Minecraft. Um, and it just makes things pointless. You know, uh, there, there is no, there is no worry. You know, at that point, it just it makes things way too easy. There, there needs to be, um, there needs to be consequences for having mending on stuff. But nope, you can just put mending on everything, and then everything is everything everything is unbreakable forever. Like who gives a shit at that point? You know. Um. But I feel like things should degrade or something if they have mending on them. If they keep getting repaired, they should um, you know, something something should happen. But nope, Minecraft's just like, ah, baby game. Let's give them a baby enchant called Mending and just, put, you know, let them put it on everything. This anchor looks dope. Just an anchor, but it looks fucking cool. <laughs> Dude, that, Poseidon is nuts, man. That thing's crazy. Smithing rock. Woof. You guys are killing it over here. This whole this whole area is just so fucking cool. I love this bit of generation too. It just doesn't make any sense. You know, but Minecraft. Um what about your guys' area up here? Is that... Can I go through all that? Or are you guys still working on that? Oh, you got rid of the fucking... The water elevator. Hey, good job. <laughs> that that did not look good. This way. Ah, you got stairs. What are you guys thinking about convenience? Yeah, but where's the wheelchair accessible ramps, huh? Elevator up to the lot. Okay. Nice. We um we have a couple of these on the server already. Bubble elevators are dope. Okay. <laughs> Coming after me. I'll, you know what? I'll 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 let you have that one because I did throw a trident at you on your on your first day on the server.
The tower looks great because it looks like the towers that we have pre-gen on the map. Keeping some frogs in here. Pedro. Nice to meet you, Pedro. Oh, hello. Frog. <laughs> okay. We gave up. We gave up immediately. Name one frog. All right. Sweet. Two frogs? Ah, fuck off. You're, you're number two. I expected a frog on the third level, too. Hello? No frogs up here. Spade Pirate's death notes? <laughs> I've been collecting mine, too. <laughs> the Granny Slayer. Is, is that person still on here? <laughs> By exploded. Evans from when Julian killed him. Fell, fell, original. What's up with the Turtle Spawn uh, Coliseum? I, I just did that for fun. The before the before the um, the server started, I put in um, some spawners in that that little room. I think it wasn't a turtle spawner though initially. I think it was a husk one. So I think someone messed with it. Just slam my face in to stop. That's that's how I handle things. <laughs> I thought this had barely finished at first, but it barely furnished. I've already seen Evan's place, so. <clears throat> oh, did you guys actually do something with the skeleton spawner? Is that the entrance? I hear him. Oh yeah, look at that. Oh, they don't they don't get hurt too much. Ooh, that's loud. Nice. Very cool. Haven't made this one into a bubble elevator yet. I like it. I also like the the lanterns behind glass. I don't know why. I don't know why it, it, it works for me, but it does. What is this? Oh, books. Look at that thing, man. Who hasn't slept over here? Guy's got a phantom issue. <laughs> Y'all are a bunch of insomniacs. I mean, yeah, Bearded, we know that you don't sleep. You always have, like, seven um, phantoms coming after you. This is Kyler's house. All right. Yeah, I think Evan told me that. It's, um, it's, it's different. <laughs> I'll, just, I'll just leave it at that. Well, uh, this is this is crazy. I have no idea what else is going to happen over here. Um, but I'm totally for it. Um, maybe we could throw some truck nuts on Poseidon or something. That'd be sick. There's more? What the fuck? Hold on. Let me let me go under the mountain. Let me uh, let me sleep. Yeah. Anytime you try to sleep, no one else does. I mean, you can tell people, you know, a bunch of people do the Z's. Yeah, let's go check out under the mountain. The hole in the mountain that Poseidon made. Wait, what am I missing here?
under. Here? Oh, fuck. <laughs> Break my neck. I need to be careful because my gear, my gear is taking some damage. The cave. Through the mountain. Over there? I don't know why I read this as Fisher Manus. Fisher Manus Cove. Ah. <laughs> Thanks for rescuing me. Oh, I like the, like, wagon wheels. <laughs> I actually thought they were wagon wheels at first. I didn't think that they were just minecart things. Um, so wait, is it down here? Is that where it is? Some fucking One Piece shit. That's Perry saying. I don't know which one's Perry, so you guys are using real people's names. All I know is Evan. And I would assume Julian's name is Julian. Just a wild guess. <laughs> Granny Slayer. Okay. Gas quarters. I mean, I, I really do like these. Like glowberry vines, they're very cool. Bed down in. Not bad. I like I like what old Granny Slayer's doing. Okay, is, is this, I, this is not the hole. This is not the hole. Then this this is the hole un, uh, the, 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 that you guys are talking about. This like carved out place. Okay. Yeah, this this area this. There's places like this um, on the server, like underneath wizard towers and stuff, where it's just like an enchanting table, just like by itself in a cave. I think it's very cool. I think it, it. I think the lore of the enchanting table needs to be crazier in Minecraft. You know, like I think I feel like it needs to be like a whole thing because it's it's just it's just a book, you know. But it it should be like a whole thing. I need to start learning Java so I can start making my own plugins and stuff. Just make things hard. Maybe that's what we'll do next server. Just make things hard. Like nothing, nothing is, nothing's vanilla anymore. Oh, poor turtle. Is that just like a block of wood in the back of it, or is that a chest? Can you just put blocks? It is a chest. Okay. That's weird. Looks like just a block of wood to me. Uh, uh, can I... Hold on. Oh, shit. Okay, wow. You guys were not kidding. There is more over there. Hold on. Wait. There's there's more over here I didn't see either. I just want to take a little peek. Is this a sushi place? Bait shop. Oh, okay. We got Nemo over here. You guys need like a little dock or something that goes around the bottom edge. Why does this look like it's like a hidden vault door or something? Like 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 some sort of like place where hobbits go to to hide, speak friend and enter sort of shit, you know? Like you're supposed to part the vines and then there's like a door behind it or something. Oh, he's a hobbit. Okay, never mind. Julian's a hobbit. All checks out. Little mushroom cave. I guess this is the Shire, right? I like this. This is very cool. This is definitely still like on brand, it feels like. Like a more more lived in area than like a forward presenting consumer facing, you know, area. Like like this is like where the all the farming and all the produce is happen and then they push it over into the onto the dock side, you know? Or maybe I'm just putting that on them. Oh, I like the little speakeasy you got here. <laughs> you come here. Oh, who gave me steaks? I'll be eating potatoes, bro. 
don't have nether wart. I got some. I'll bring. I'll, I I can bring you some. Yeah. Also, just FYI, you can also just slash sit. So you can just sit wherever you want. Like, it doesn't even need to be on these things. So, if you ever just want to take a little break, you can. Just a big, big field over here. Ah, I, 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 I got, I got a, I got a soft spot for like non-traditional farms in Minecraft, where it's like, it's not built efficiently. It's built a little sporadic and a little bit more natural feeling. I fucking, I, I, I fuck with this. <laughs> you know, this is, this is dope. It's a, it's a bitch to farm and actually like harvest from, but it looks so good. Just like the natural rolling hills of stuff, you know? This is sick. This is cool. Man, this is going to be... I don't I, I don't know like how much more you guys plan on doing in this area, but if it keeps continuing like this, it's going to be wild, you know? Spanning... Oh, sorry. I was looking at Evan. I would assume probably that way. But it's the only way that stuff hasn't been being built. I'm going strong. Yeah, don't burn yourselves out. Just FYI. You guys are doing great work. You guys are doing great work. Just don't burn yourself out, all right? Pace yourself. Think about things. Take a little bit of time. Don't don't think that you gotta just knock everything out quick. So wait, did you guys build that lighthouse then? Is that from you guys? We didn't check this out yet. Old Granny Slayer did. Perry the Granny Slayer. <laughs> Perry the Gilf Hunter. Not bad. Uh, let me get you some nether warts. What was that, like a nine, a three by three? Can't use commands. I was about to type slash back. I was like, you can't do that anymore. Yeah, no, that was killer. Um, I don't think that you guys know about our server Saturday plugin, but like the whole point of server Saturday is to show off cool builds on the server. That was like the initial um, like concept of server Saturday was that I'd go and explore all the builds on the server. You did submit it. Okay. So the problem with group builds is like the way that our server Saturday plugin wor works is that it, after it gets featured, I, I, I label it as featured. It gives you a free key. Um, but for group builds that doesn't, you know, that doesn't work out too uh, hot because there's multiple people that worked on it and you only get one key, you know? So um, I need to make sure to, get you guys um all keys for 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 the work on here um so you're welcome i hope it i hope it comes in handy ow <laughs> ooh what happens when you fly through a portal ah fuck no wait what happens when you fly through a portal ah fuck <laughs> I'm gonna kill myself. in the video game Twitch. <laughs> oh my god, I have one heart. Jesus Christ. This is why my helmet has taken so much damage. It's just I'm so shit with the Elytra. <laughs> I heard that Gilf Hunter is the new class releasing for a while. True. Yeah, you're not wrong. Okay. Oosh. Okay. It doesn't do anything. Ooh, but the sound plays. 
You submitted the samurai statue. Not much, but you can go inside. Interesting. Okay, well, hold on. Let me... Okay, so there is... It is worthwhile for me to, to pop back over. I, I didn't think that anybody actually submitted anything. Um, so I should go... I should pop back over. Let me let me tour the, the statue. <laughs> Come on, man. Get my helmet. I need to. I need to swap, anyways, so I can um, give those guys the keys too. Welcome to the Warrior's Tower. Probably should be eating those steaks. They're better than potatoes. Tree helm. Somewhere throughout the many years of Earth's history, there may or may not have been a knight who was also a samurai. Samurai knight. I like that you can get into his mask. Peek out. This is cool. I like that you can pop over on the inside, too. So is the sword always going to be floating? Is that a thing? Or you just haven't built the arm yet? Man, we really need to fill out like this area more. Need to need to start working on some other stuff. And I, or I mean, I don't know. <laughs> I I feel more connected to Nubtown than I do my own personal build. Probably flow for now. Okay. I mean, it looks cool from the from a distance, so. Like it looks it looks cool from here. Um Man, coming back into my little like cistern feels a little blank. Feels I I need to I need to I need to go through and zhuzh it up a bit more. Let me um opening armor is added. Looks really cool right now though. Yeah. I think it I think it looks neat. I need to um change accounts and check the server Saturday file to make sure that we're we have rewards set. Um, so I shouldn't, I've been recording during that anyways. It's just going to try to recover it. Uh, all right, let me look at the file really quick. This is good because we have not used this plugin yet on this map, so it'll be good to see if it works. Uh, rewards. Okay, yeah, these are these are rewards rewards that are need need to be given. Uh, I'm gonna change these. I'm gonna change these to elder keys. I think. I think I'm just gonna change it to an elder key. I'm gonna give you guys an elder key for submitting stuff. I had it set to just one of each, but I I think I'm gonna change it to an elder key because. Um, if you're if you're taking the effort to build dope shit and then submit it for server Saturday. Why not? Why not give you an elder key, you know? Uh, all right. I need to switch to this account. Which takes forever because Mojang. Of course we got to reload the, the launcher. Why, why not? We, we have to reload the launcher. What is this music, man? I feel like I'm still in the samurai t statue. No, I don't want to recover that. Is that music from Outward? It didn't look like it. Currently using outdated of ProQuest. I know, but no, we're not using ProQuest at all. Uh, okay, so I think it's uh, Server Saturday view all. Yeah. Okay, so we have Speed Pirate Space. Um, 
Tato's place, which was a test one, and my awesome build was also a test one. So samurai shampoo. Let's see. Telekinesis bro, he lost his arms during the great Sengoku period, 14th century conflict. Resource pack. Any glowstone? What do you, what? Do you, what? <laughs> uh okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna click this one as featured. Samurai, can you check to see if you got a notification? Oh wait, I didn't reload that though. <laughs> I need to reload the plugin. Because I changed the config. So you it should have Oh, shit. It might have run it before. See if you get the two keys or if you got the elder key. Because I think I think it just tells you that you have a key. What'd you do? You just said yes. Did you get the two keys or did you get the elder key? Or did you get a notification? You got an elder. Okay. Sick. And it, cool. And it takes it off of my thing here. Okay, let me let me just feature these ones so they get off of my page. That way when I look it up, I just see Oh, <laughs> damn it. I I did Samurai Knight. What? Okay. So, Evan, I think you might have gotten a key just then. <laughs> also, why does Lucid have a bounty? <laughs> Uh, real Honda Civic. No. Uh, Samurai, how does it how does it come in? <laughs> it was being naughty. <laughs> does it does it just tell you like you have a reward on the bottom of your screen? Like you have a um a, a crate or whatever waiting for you. Weirdly enough, I've not been on the receiving side of Server Saturday, but I think. Hey, you have rewards waiting for you in, in, in the message, like above your health bar or whatever. Click the, Oh, click this message. Did you see something in your, your chat then Evan? Or did you take off that build? I thought I just clicked accept on, um, no real Honda civic. Uh, Oh, it's not been, it's not ready to be featured anymore. Featured. What about now? Yes. Okay. And did that give you an elder key? One elder. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Um, how many people helped with this build? How m Be honest with me. How many people deserve an elder key for helping out in this build? Four, I think is what he's saying there. <laughs> Four, including you, Evan. This is the only problem with, with it is that Granny, Evan, Julian, and I. Okay. Who can I trust Perry's key to? Oh, and Roman? And, come on. All right. Let's be honest. All right. Did, did Roman actually help? Did Roman actually help? He did the tower. All right. Okay. All right. All right. So there's there's two more. All right. So there's that's the 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 extra one is for for Granny and then Roman. Okay. Good job, guys. Looks looks awesome. I don't know why my field of view I feel like changes when I change accounts, but it does. Felt weird. Good luck on your rolls. Um, it's up to you if you want to give them their keys or not. Uh, okay. I think that that's, that's good. If you guys uh, haven't yet, um, server Saturday plugin is still on the server and you can do forward slash SS for server Saturday and you can, uh, wherever you're standing, I think if you do new, it'll make the teleport there. Uh, cause typically since I've already viewed these ones, so I know where they're at, but if you click on it, um, Oh, the night and castle, I think it's the both that I did there. Um, I can teleport to wherever it is. Um, 
because when you do new, when you submit a new one, it, it takes the location that you're currently at as the teleportation thing. Then you fill out the rest of the information. Um, how to use this command and stuff like that is on the uh, Discord. Under Mongoose Coast, the section for Mongoose Coast, Coast and then the how-to guide. Um, right here on the bottom bottom section here on how to submit stuff. Um, so that's how you submit things and other useful commands and everything. They're all here. The IP, if you're watching this and you'd like to play, the IP is found here. Uh, if you can't figure out how to get into the discord and get and figure all that part out, Minecraft is too hard for you. Right. <clears throat> when you fill out the info, it says it in chat. Is that normal? I think so. I don't know. You're going to have to ask Bruce. These are Bruce questions, not 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 Dwight questions. I tried to fly. Can't fly on this guy. Got to enable fly. So that's how you can submit stuff. Um, I guess I could submit my own stuff, but I, I think I'll I'll leave it up to you guys. Um, so I think uh, I think we're going to call server Saturday here. I think typically I try to go for two hours, but I don't think it has to hit two hours every time. Um. This has been fun. There's, oh, that's a, a regular village <laughs> build. Um, I think what I'm going to do, uh, I'm gonna, I think I'm going to play for a little bit longer off stream today um, and move these, just move this stuff over there. Um, had we not spent so much time doing everything else, I'd probably work on this thing, but I'll save that, I guess, for another episode. Um and yeah, uh, thanks everybody for coming out. Hopefully you guys had fun. I'm going to actually, you know what? Why don't we just do one of these? And then even better, we'll do, we'll activate a booster as well. There we go. Guys get some more experience. There's going to be a second fishing competition in 36 minutes. So if you guys are watching this live, there's going to be a second competition, second fishing comp. That's going to happen. Um, I will pass off the knowledge of adding repair notes to be purchased with money. That way you guys don't need to work around the item thing uh, off to Bruce or if I have time today at some point, I'll do it. Um, but um, yeah, I will talk to you guys later. Have a wonderful rest of your weekend. And uh, if anything, I'll see you next Saturday for uh, another server Saturday or a miscellaneous stream throughout the week because uh, I have more magic cards that I want to open and um, there's a couple boxes coming. So anyways, I'll catch you guys later. Have a wonderful time.